Long live the queen. Lady Sizoff. Soldier boys, boy. Smoke them if you got them. If you so much as lift a finger against Outworld, I can do whatever I want. Take one. Just say, damn. You have more heart than you let on. Allow me to reset your expectations. <laughs> Take one.
him! Who's your queen? Fatality. <laughs> Sindel wins. Sub-Zero. Agent of Chaos. With one act, you betrayed two realms. Neither deserved my loyalty. Take one. Action! Electricity can burn. Mustard. Your daughter fought well against me. Unfortunately, not well enough. Take one. Action! <laughs>
brutality. Sindel wins. Cleric of Chaos. Incorruptible. Leaders should be chosen by people, not gods. I prefer those who aren't self-appointed. <laughs> You should have brought the Earth Realmers to me. At the time, I didn't know I could trust you. Take one. Action! Sindel. 
Lady Sizoff. Return home, you rapacious fiend. Not until I add this timeline to my empire. Take more. Action! Though known for compassion, I'm no stranger to wrath. That fact has not escaped me, Empress. <laughs>
darkness enveloped me, I took a long last look at my family. I did not expect to see them again until their souls joined mine in the living forest. But miraculously, my beloved husband delivered me from oblivion. Though he couldn't save my body, Jared had preserved my soul. Like him and countless others, I am now a part of Ermac. Yet ours is not a peaceful repose. The collected souls within Ermac have their own needs and agendas. Before we can speak as one, we must first reach consensus. I had thought, as the former rulers of Outworld, I and Jared would hold sway. But here we are, two souls among many thousands, fighting for the right to be heard. And if there is one thing we do well together, it is fight. We will win the right to govern Ermac as we once had governed Outworld. And we will rule for the benefit of all.